Hello, I'm Katie from Midnight Music and welcome to the final video in a series of Audacity tips for music teachers. In this video, we'll look at how you can use Audacity to remove vocals from a song. In all honesty, I'm not finding this is so necessary anymore. There are plenty of high quality backing tracks available for purchase for only a couple of dollars each through the iTunes Store or through the Google Play Store. You can search for a song name plus the word karaoke at the end. However, if you can't find what you need there, this might be worth a try. Removing vocals from a recording doesn't always give you a great result. The result depends on how the recording was made in the first place, and in particular the way in which the track was mixed. Audacity uses a plugin to remove vocals that are panned to the centre of a stereo mix, that is, the vocals are identical in both channels. The problem is that sometimes other instruments, like the kick drum and the bass, are centre panned as well. So if that's the case, the plugin will remove those instruments along with the vocals. The other thing is you can't usually remove all of the vocals. There's often some residual vocals left behind. If you want to try the vocal remover, first import your audio file and then go to Effects, Vocal Remover for Centre Panned Vocals. A dialog will open, simply click OK and then check the result by playing back your audio file. Vocals have been removed and the remaining audio file sounds OK, save or export it. If the plugin removes instruments that you want to keep in the audio file, you might have the option of selecting a specific frequency band for the vocals to remove instead. This will only work successfully if the vocals that you're trying to remove are in a different frequency range to the other instruments in the backing track. To do that, go to Effects, Vocal Remover for Centre Pan Vocals, and then type in the frequency band that you want to remove here. Listen to the result again, and if all is good, save or export the result. These tips are from the Amazing Audacity online course for music teachers. For more information, visit midnightmusic.com.au forward slash audacity online.